Prince Charles felt very exposed by Harry but future king guilty of exact same tactics. Prince Harry wanted to get a message through about the fractures in his relationship with his father, according to royal commentators. The Duke of Sussex has been speaking candidly in public about his struggles in the monarchy, as well as his upbringing with Prince Charles. Channel 5 documentary, Charles and Harry, Father and Son Divided discussed how the future king has been reacting to the revelations. Relationship psychologist Angela Mutanda told viewers, you could see that it was difficult for Harry to speak about his relationship with his family. But at the same time, he wanted to. He wanted to get a message through that he has struggled deeply with what has been going on. And that there are definite fractures in the relationship. She continued, these are seismic statements to make about one's own family members. I wonder whether, from Charles' point of view, he would have felt very exposed by his son. The documentary pointed out that the Sussex's Oprah interview had echoes of Charles' own revealing sit down in the 1990s. In a one on one with Jonathan Dimbleby, the future king admitted to infidelity in his marriage. Royal author Tom Quinn told Channel 5, in the back of Charles' mind, there would have been a certain amount of guilt. It would have brought up memories of his own attempt way back in 1994 to get the media on his side. So, on one hand, he was being criticized by Harry and probably very upset by that. He added, but, on the other hand, it's very difficult for him to attack his son for doing something that he himself did when he was young. During his CBS interview, Harry said he felt that he had been let down by his father. The Duke described being financially cut off and having Charles stop taking his calls. Appearing on the Armchair Expert podcast, he pointed to the future king's own troubled upbringing as a reason for the cycle of genetic pain. He also said that it was something he wanted to break for his own children.